What's up for discussion? Rechtei hathran rust. Frey, vald isk durovna. Frey, vald isk ablast. You recognize the funeral rites of the Gur people, the same monster hunters you met in the Hag Swamp. Their leader is burning the possessions of those who have fallen. Im orak, nete, krasin, netra. So, the impossible spawn walks among us in the blazing sun. We have been looking for you. The last time your friend came to our camp, he stole our children, our future. When we sent Gandrel after you, we wanted to interrogate you, to discover how to save our children and then destroy you. But things have changed. You have changed. Is it true you left your master? That you broke the spell that binds you to him? Uh, well, I, I mean, uh, kind of. It's a long story, honestly. Free. Not while his master still lives. But he has, perhaps, earned a second chance. We have tried to save our children once already, attacking Kazadorzar's palace at first light. Even then, it was too well defended. But if his own spawn approached, someone he thought he could control, he would throw his doors open and welcome you in. And once inside, you could do what we could not. You could save the children you damned. You don't know Cazador like I do. He's merciless. You want me to march into the lion's den and save your children? But I promise you, they're already dead. I spent 200 years bringing him victims! Each and every one was whisked away to be fed on that night. But you never saw him feed yourself. He could keep prisoners for days before killing them. If our children are truly gone, then we ask for blood. I know you can understand that, Spawn. I suppose. Yes. Yes. Revenge I can do. Thank you. From me and all my people. If you can do this, we will be in your debt. You have lived a life of violence and sin. You have stolen lives, broken families, and caused immeasurable grief. Doing this will not right those wrongs. <laughs> If you're trying to encourage me, you're failing abysmally. But it will be a start. You may still be redeemed. Please go. Time is short, but we will see you again when it is done. Do not stand here and wait. Cazador must be destroyed.
can't slow down. I need a quick word. A another guest for the Master's celebration. I'm afraid you're too late. You'll have to... Master Astarian? What are you doing here? Why aren't you downstairs? Well, obviously I'm on my way down now. So if you could just point us in the right direction. But you're too late. The, the, the doors have been sealed. The ritual is about to begin. It's too late. Godi has sealed the doors and will not open them until the ritual is complete. Casador gave the key to Godi. And where is this sadistic old sack of bones? It does not matter. You're too late. The master will be so angry that you missed the ritual. He will do such terrible, terrible things to you. I do not have any more time to waste. There is too much to do, too much to prepare. All right, he what now? Tonight we shall see his truth. That door is saturated with necrotic magic. Let's keep my distance. We be worthy of you. Behold! One of Cazador's cheapest tricks. An illusionary wall. Behind it is the kennel. I fought for an ambush. I know you're there, Golly. Stop skulking and show yourself. You always were sharp, little one. Sharp enough to cut yourself. It's taking everything I have not to grind your rotten carcass to dust. Don't be mad at Cody, child. I only did my job. Only kept you in line. You tortured us. For days at a time. Oh, yes. And you sang so sweetly for me. None of the others screamed like you did. But you're home now, and you brought me a treat, eh? <laughs> a new friend for Godi. Not very nice. Not very friendly. Why are you here then, little one, if not to see Godi? We're here to see the Master. But the ballroom door's locked. Uh, give us the key. <laughs> no, no, it is too late. The doors are sealed on Master's orders. Godi will not open them for anyone, much less for you. Oh, yes. Fight Godi. Spill your blood on his kennel's floor. <laughs>
before. Inscribed on the Tsar's signet ring, I think. covered in intricate text, but you can't see anywhere a key might fit. Only a small round hollow engraved with a family crest. Looking closer, you recognize the writing. It's the same Kozakuran script from the dictionary you found. The ring slots perfectly into place and the door swings open. Cazador never kept guard dogs before. <sighs> the runaway spawn. <clears throat> you reek of the master's scent. Come with us. Come to master. Uh, excuse me. I will not be ordered around my own house by some blowing mutt. <sighs> we bring you to him. We get his favor. Still breathing, despite everything. You stand on a clean metal platform. A beautiful but antiquated elevator. There are some scuffs to show its age, signs of things dragged onto it over the years. But it seems to be in good working order. What in the hells? I never knew this was here. This was always Cazador's private quarters. Only he ever came in here. Well, him and the unfortunate souls we brought to feed him. in the hells? I never knew any of this was here. Just like the door to the ballroom upstairs, its door features no keyhole. It does have an indentation for a signet ring. The ring slots perfectly into place, and the door opens, assailing you with pungent, musty air. Approaching the cells, you're... Who stands before us? Is this truly our prodigal son? Hm? Do not slouch before me, boy! Have you no respect for yourself? Look at you. Crawling back after abandoning your family. You should be begging our forgiveness. Forgiveness? You've never forgiven anything. Every mistake, every slip was punished. I strove for perfection in all things. Even those as imperfect as you. A pity you amounted to so little, despite my efforts. No! No. 
fuck you. And fuck everything you've ever done to me. I will not speak to cattle. This is between me and the boy. You son of a bitch. You truly forgot my power. You truly thought our bond as creator and creation was all that stopped you from killing me? Hmm? Oh, you are weak, my child. You are a small, pathetic little boy who never amounted to anything. But today, you will finally do something worthwhile. You will burn, and I will ascend. Fear you again. But if I finish the ritual you started, I'll never have to fear anyone. Ever. You think me a fool? That I would allow anyone to usurp me, speak the words, and ascend in my place? Hm? The runes I carved into your flesh bind you and all 7,000 souls to the ritual. Complete it, and those bearing the scars will be sacrificed, you included. You are simply a means to an end. I made you to be consumed. I am so much more than what you made me. Get over here! We can do this. If we release them, how many people will they kill? Tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. But if I complete the ritual, think of the power I'll have. With me by your side, we can, we can save the city. We can save ourselves. You... You're right. I can be better than them. But I'm not above enjoying this.
Is... Is it over? Is he... <sighs> yes. He's gone. What does that mean for us? You can do whatever you want. Sounds terrifying. And it is. But there's opportunity in it too. You can hide here, living in the shadows like parasites. Or you could be more than what he made us to be. You can choose differently, of course. But the consequences are on your head. And what does it mean for them? Now, that's a better question. 7,000 spawn from ancient conquests to stolen children. Casador's staff controlled everything during the ritual. If it controls the cells too, you can decide their fate. Some sacrifices just aren't worth it. The poor wretches in the cells are innocent. They shouldn't have to suffer just because I... lured them here. someone to lead them. Take the tunnels into the Underdark. Find somewhere, well, not safe, but less perilous. What? No, we can't. Just try to keep them out of trouble. I think we're done here. Let's go. That's it. He's gone. After all these years, these centuries, it's really over. I'm glad you think so, because I'm not so sure. I just feel... numb. What I've lost. <laughs> what I've gained. It's all so much. And God, all those spawn. Free in the Underdark. I need some time, I think. I... Just to let it all sink in. Let's just go. This place reeks of death, and I want to feel alive again. At the ready. You killed one vampire, but released 7,000 of his spawn. Have you lost all sense? They were innocents. To kill them would have been an even greater crime. Uh, but if you do decide to go hunting them, know they include your children. They... Oh, they survived? Well, that depends on how you define survived, really. But they are free. They're making their way into the Underdark as we speak. This is... difficult news. We will need to decide what it means. 
Thank you for what you have done. Slaying Cazador was a great justice. As for the rest, well, time will tell. <laughs>